How we doing, YouTube? Sim here. It's been a week or so since I talked to you. Oh, what's been going on? It's not too dark. I don't think it's too dark. No. <coughs> I turn the light, maybe. Oh, that's a little better, isn't it? Yeah, that's quite a little bit better. <coughs> I got this stupid cough that just will not go away. I don't really feel bad, but uh, yeah, I still got a nagging cough. Oh, let's see. When was the last time I talked to you? I don't think I'd started for J.B. Hunt yet. I was in the last week. Um, end of the week before. Today's the uh, 20... <coughs> 22nd. I thought that's what it was. 22nd. Monday the 22nd. I am... I don't know where I am. On my way to Kansas City. Anyway. I don't know the name of this little town. I don't know these little towns on the... Outside of my normal Evansville loop. Um, this is my second trip to Kansas City. Since I've been at uh, J.B. Hunt Power Only. Uh, not too bad a run down here and back. I, I will say that. Um, the mile is just pretty close to about where I need it to be. About 500 each way. A little more than that. 550. Depending where it blowed from. I've loaded from two different places. One was on the west side of Chicago, Romeoville. Is it Romeoville? Yeah, I think it was Romeoville. And then this one loaded up in Frankfurt, which was um, probably maybe a little farther away than Romeoville from my house, but easier to get to. I didn't have to go through the city. It's outside the city and didn't have to pay any tolls. So I'd rather go to Frankfurt. It was a free lay down there. Uh, matter of fact, the one in Romeoville, I think, was a free lay as well, but it may have been just a warehouse. I think it was just a warehouse trying to think where I loaded. No, 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 no. I picked up a trailer from a Frito-Lay warehouse, but I <coughs> I loaded out of a pack tiv, which is, you know, aluminum foil and cardboard junk like that. And brought it down here, yeah. And then I had a shorty that I did on, let's see, I did that on Monday, Tuesday, did a shorty on Wednesday, and ended up not getting anything on Thursday and Friday. And then I had this one on the books for Monday, today. And I'm not going right back up to Ohio, Finley, for tomorrow, deliver on Wednesday morning. And any, oh, any time on Wednesday. And I've been looking for something out of the kind of western side of Ohio there. Coming back, either back down towards Kansas City or back to the south side of the city. <clears throat> and I can't find anything for the 24th. I need it for the 24th. And I can't find anything. Right now on their load board, there's only five loads coming out of Indy. Now, granted, it's nighttime. It's 830 at nighttime. Um, but there's only five loads coming out of Indiana and only five loads coming out of Illinois. And that's for the next week. So, if this load board is not... I don't want to talk bad about J.B. Hunt. I've only been here a week and a couple days, so. But just from what I've seen so far, and the load board I'm on is a different load board from their regular 360 load board. Uh, the fellow that brought me on kind of indicated this was better. I don't know that it's better or not, but he said they got a little more control over so they can kind of keep track of everybody. And my authority's still kind of new compared for them, so they wanted to kind of keep track of me. Well, the problem is, is with the load board that I'm seeing anyway, is they have a fair bit of freight coming down, like from Indiana, where I live at, Northwest Indiana, Chicago. Land. Freight coming down to the Kansas City area, freight going over into Pennsylvania, freight going to the Carolinas. <clears throat> the freight going to the Carolinas is not too bad, but it doesn't pay much coming back. The freight going to Pennsylvania pays the most, but you guys well know living on the northern side of Indiana, if you're going to run to Pennsylvania, you're running that toll road, and that toll road is expensive. So, in the end of the day, I don't think it's any any more money to go over to Pennsylvania. Plus, you got the mountains, you're not getting the fuel economy, and then you got to get something out of Pennsylvania, and that board, their board for that, is doesn't seem to be real zippy. Let's just say. Um, this load that I have now coming south and the one that I brought last week is a light load it's not heavy at all 
But the loads I bring back out of Kansas City, well, the one I'm bringing tomorrow back to Ohio, like 38, 30 some, like 38,000. <coughs> but the one I brought a week ago was 43,000. And it was every bit of it. It was every bit of that 43,000. And this old um, energy efficient Cummins, it does not like to be that heavy. So I had great fuel mileage coming down, but I had not so good mileage going back, which I need to remember when I do hopper work because hopper work is heavy all the time. <coughs> so this truck won't get very good fuel economy. Whenever I do my budget, I need to make sure to factor that in. This truck's not going to get good fuel mileage well in hopper. But, uh, um, yeah, so anyway, uh, the, so the JV hunt's okay. I'm not going to throw the baby out with the bathwater quite yet. Uh, but I will say that I think from the rates that I'm seeing right now, compared to rates on the load board, or the, like that board, I don't know that it's really that much different to be pulling my own trailer and rather than pulling theirs. The fuel discount that they offer and other, see these big companies, you know, they all got different. Uh, it's not all one thing. So they'll put you on, you know, we got this group, we got that group. And so there's like their, their owner operator or there's their lease company, guys running under their own authority, running under JB Hunt's authority. It's like on a 360 board. And then the board I'm using is something different. And then I don't know about the company drivers, what they do with them. But anyway, the same, I think, goes for the fuel card. Because the fuel discount, I watched a guy, I can't remember his name. I'd give him a plug that was talking about his fuel discount. He runs under their numbers. And his fuel count discount was pretty good. My fuel discount is not very good at all. Matter of fact, the discount that they give me or offer me, is worse than my discount as a single truck owner operator with my pilot card. So I'm not even using, <clears throat> now I did fill out a thing to get one of their fuel cards, but I'm not going to use it. Because um, it doesn't, I said their, their discount's not, it's, it's less than mine. So anyway, that doesn't make any sense. And that was one of the reasons I thought that might make this JB Hunt work, is if I could get a good fuel discount, but it looks like I won't. Now I want to clarify, I think I could make money over here once I learn how to run this load board a little bit better, but I'm probably not going to be able to consistently go where I want to go. And that's the other thing. What I really am looking for is a dedicated loop like I had when I was with ARCA. The only problem with the ARCA load was it was dedicated, but they didn't have enough freight. Not ARCA's fault, but the company I was hauling to didn't have enough freight to keep, keep me busy as they normally would in normal years and wasn't going to going into the future. So there was a mistake. This board at JB Hunt, I also, I. I don't think I can get a regular, even when, when I see the load, you know, if I watch, 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 no, okay, this load, like on the Schneider board, I think sometimes you can watch and learn, okay, this load coming out of this place is going to come up, you know, at this time on this day. So you can kind of look for it. I don't think, I haven't got that vibe yet from this board. And like I said, that's what I'm really looking for is something that's dedicated. I want to go to the same place every, all the time, that same loop, all the time, all the time, all the time. Even if it's a little bit less money, the consistency is, is what I'm looking for. So, um, but we're going to, you know, we're going to run this for another week or two anyway, just to see what happens. And then I'll either go buy a trailer, or I'll lease one or something. And, uh, or maybe the hopper freight will be a little bit better than we'll run that. But anyway, God bless everybody. We'll talk again soon.